in life, in career, in business, in pretty much everything you do, focus on things that truly matter. And they might be different for all of us, but besides certain commonalities such as health and happiness of our families, our closest friends, our own health, um, not many things are as important as those are, no matter who you are and what you do. So it is important to understand and reflect on your past actions and decisions and understand that things that were of great importance, great urgency at that moment, a week ago, a month ago, a year ago, today, don't really matter as much. Some of them are almost entirely inconsequential to where you are and more importantly, where you're going. So try to keep your perspective fresh and vary it and look at not only what you're doing today and how you're focusing on your future and your next move or your next career goals and your growth, the growth of your business if you're an entrepreneur, right, small business owner, whatever you may be, every once in a while look back on major things and major accomplishments and try to recall the emotions you felt at that time and compare them to how you feel about it today. Now, that doesn't mean that I advocate for anyone to fall within layers of mediocrity and being average by no means. But I do say that it's very important to allow yourself to be reflective of where you are, where you stand, where you're going, and not to waste time, passion, energy, drive, commitment, focus on details, on things, on areas, on projects that do not matter and do not produce that large of a return on investment. Think about it, order your own life, professional, personal, and I'm willing to bet that you're going to come across things that were very urgent to you, whether they're important or not, that's really up to you to decide, but they required you to stop so many things, to focus, to beg, to borrow, to plead. And now when you look at them from a different vantage point on your timeline, you understand how little they truly mean in your professional and personal pursuits. Have a wonderful day. Wish you all the best. As always, if this is the first video you see, please consider subscribing and sharing it with your friends. Finally, and most importantly, please leave your comment on this content or anything else I've posted on this channel because I'm very interested in learning what your thoughts were and what your experiences have been thus far in your careers. Have a wonderful day.